you have the Samsung Galaxy S21 5G, very cool phone, and you are wondering if you can make it run a little faster, a little snappier, a little quicker. The answer is yes. I'm going to give you two things. One you should be very, very familiar with, and then the other way is something that uh, is not, is it like a hidden hack, and maybe you haven't done it before. So let's get into it. The first thing we want to do for the first method to make your phone a little quicker, a little snappier, let me do that again so you can see how I got here. We're going to go into settings. Inside settings, we're going to scroll all the way down and you should see device care. Touch device care. All you have to do is touch optimize now and it's going to help you with the battery, apps, background apps, storage issues, memory issues. You can click done. Okay, sometimes it makes sense to go into storage and see if you have trash to remove this phone I just cleaned it so there's not much trash. Okay. Last thing to check is memory. You can always see if you, your, your phone can give you a little extra memory. So I've got contacts open, my files, and notes. So just a few things inside of device care can help your phone run a little bit snappier, crisper. And let's get into number two. Number two, let's back out all the way out of here. All right, same thing. We want to get into settings. Inside settings, I'm going to cover up some private information. We're going to touch about phone. Inside about phone, we're going to touch software information. When we touch software information, we're looking for build number. Touch build number seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And you should get the developer mode has been turned on. Okay. Right here, you're going to back up one spot. You're going to back up a second spot, and we're back into settings. Now, inside settings, now we scroll down a little further, you have developer options. Touch developer options. Now, here's something that some people are uncomfortable with. This is the internal software of your phone. If you accidentally touch something while you're scrolling, because we have to scroll way down, just click cancel or click back. All right? So, while we scroll down, we're going to look for a topic called, or a heading called, Drawing. See how that one's networking. And the next one, there's input right here. And then after input is drawing. In drawing, you should see these three options window animation scale, transition animation scale, animator duration scale. Now, some people say, hey, uh, turn that. If you touch it, you want to turn it to 0.5. The smaller the number, the quicker your phone goes. The bigger the number, you don't want to make it bigger. Okay. I like to turn the animations off. So let's go that way. Transition, turn it off. Animator, turn off. Okay, we're done. Let's click home. Now let's compare. This is S22 Ultra, S21 5G. Now we're just going to do a couple things to prove that making those adjustments inside developer settings is going to make your phone quicker and snappier. Watch this. Just bring up the phone. Do you see that? Snaps on, blinks on. This one kind of grows out of its icon. Now let's close out of the phone. Blinks off, and this one kind of slowly melts back into its icon. You want to see that again? Try to touch them at the exact same time. Try to touch on the... Oh, nope. Try to close them at the exact same time. Blinks off, kind of closes into it. Let's bring up Messenger. Blinks on, got some work to do. Let's close out of Messenger. Blinks off, takes its time melting back into its icon. Let's bring up the phone, or the camera. Camera's ready to go. Let's see, we don't need that extra thing. Take a picture of some cool background, and then watch what happens when we close out of camera. Blinks off, melts back down into its icon. You can see with your own eyes that making those adjustments make your phone a little snappier, a little quicker. And if you're someone who makes videos, sends a text, sends a message, gets on an app and you're, you're maneuvering and you're doing lots of work on your phone, you will notice a difference by making those changes. Now, I want to thank you for your time. Thank you for watching. Please like, please subscribe. Now, if you want to see how to undo those changes, in case you didn't like it, let's go back into settings. Go back into settings. I'm going this way this time. Oops, sound of vibration. 
And I'm going to go down. Oh, I don't have to do anything. I don't have to cover it. Let's go back to developer options. Inside developer options, we're going to scroll down without accidentally touching anything. We're looking for drawing. There's input and drawing is next. Now to undo those, remember the default is 1x. Turn it back to 1x. Window animation scale, transition animation scale, and animator duration scale. 1x and you are done. And if you are someone who wants to be super safe and not accidentally get back into here and touch something that you shouldn't then that makes your phone work wonky, just turn the developer options off. Click home and that is it. All right, if this has helped you, please like, please subscribe. Thank you for watching.